Hello everybody. Uh, in continuity with my other videos yesterday, I'm going to do a review of uh, DVDs. First up today, I'm going to do is of Apple Seed X Machina. I have the two disc collector's edition. Uh, Apple Seed X Machina, I don't know where it sits in the timeline of Apple Seed story, but uh, it it's a very good movie nonetheless. It has, of course, Shinji uh, Adamaki, who did the original, and John Woo. Uh, it's adapted by from Shiramasa Moon's manga series. If you don't know who Shiramasa Moon is, it's he's from Ghost in the Shell, and. Uh, it's a very good movie. It's got a lot of action. I mean, it has John Woo in the helm as one of the uh, producers. And, I mean, John Woo is a very action-oriented person, but he's also very story-driven. And this rings true for that because they use uh, doves in this movie just like John Woo did and a lot of the other things. And there's a lot of bullet time in this, but there's a very deep story. <laughs> And uh Briarios, it's that's uh Briarios is uh the guy who's uh standing next to Dunin. And Dunin is the woman on the cover. But uh Briarios actually faces someone who's a clone of him which is called the Bioroid. And there's a copy of him in his human form. And some say that when they, those two fight, it's man versus machine, or it's an internal struggle actualized in the real world. Instead of being in his head, it's right there on paper. And, I mean, it's it's a very good movie. It's got a very good story. Uh, rent it, if you like anime. If you like anime movies. Uh, this is in 3D. It's a CGI movie. But it's a very good movie. Uh, if you don't want to buy it, rent it. Then buy it if you want to. Get the dual disc because it has special features. Uh, it actually shows the def uh, definite history of uh, of Appleseed. Uh, there's also a different. There's things where. Uh, it's East, Meets, West, similarities and variations in how different cultures enjoy the art form. And there's, I mean, there's director commentary, filmmaker commentary. Uh, there's a thing about John Woo and Shinji Aramaki uh, meeting in Deus Ex, or not Deus Ex, but Appleseed Ex Machina. And, uh, I mean... A lot of John Woo signature things are in here, like doves and gunplay. But in the original Apple Seed, there's a lot of gunplay in tribute to John Woo. And to have them work, have him working on it is, is a miracle. And people don't realize this, but John Woo's work is story driven, and most people just remember the gunplay. But uh, yeah, it's a freaking wonderful movie. It's it's a wonderful movie, a wonderful... Appleseed is good. Uh, I don't know exactly where Ex Machina fits in the Appleseed timeline, as I said but in the beginning. Uh, great visuals, great storytelling. Uh, I mean, it's, it's a very, very, very awesome movie. Great voice acting. It's a very good dub, and you usually don't see a good dub of anime. But this is a very good dub. Uh, Dune Nu is a very strong character. So is Briarios. Not just physically, but emotionally. And uh, what else can I say? Rent it. Buy it. If you like anime, buy it. Because it's a very good anime movie. It's a very good any kind of movie. Uh, I mean... <laughs> Uh, be careful because it's PG-13, so don't get it for 12-year-olds. And there's a lot of violence and there's a lot of screwed up things in it. Well, not screwed up, but I mean, there's graphic. There's not really graphic violence. It's just some of the deaths are really heartbreaking. 
like when Briarios has to shoot and kill his friend because he's getting transformed by the carrier wave that's being transmitted. He has to kill him because he's trying to kill everybody else, so he has to uh, end his life. And that plays a big part. I mean, that's really a tragic moment in the series and in the movie. Uh, other than that, I mean, you just you gotta watch it. I mean, the action sequences, the storytelling, as I said. Uh, people are, it's, um, what I say is very redundant, but, uh, I mean, it's just that kind of good that you, the only things you can say are that it's good storytelling, good, good, uh, graphics, good CGI, good storytelling, good everything. Uh, five out of five, I give this a five out of five or 10 out of 10, uh, but whichever scale you prefer. As I said, uh, rent it, watch it, uh, buy it if you like it. But uh, yeah, I would check it out. That's all I'm gonna say. Just check it out. If that's all you do, just watch it and be on the lookout for another DVD re uh, <laughs> review, either later tonight on YouTube or some other time. But, yeah, check out Appleseed Ex Machina on DVD, get the dual disc DVD. Uh, that's all I really got to say about that, so everybody go out, see the movie, rent it, and do whatever you really want to do.